Yo, what's going on YouTube and welcome to Hyper Light Drifter. Now, for those of you that don't know, this is an upcoming 2D action role-playing game developed by the guys over at Heart Machine. It's due to be released later on this year, but it's currently available to play in early sort of early access, early preview build. You can get it through Steam, you can buy it through the website, um, and I have decided to kind of run through, sort of like give you the first sort of like glimpse of the game. Um, it's designed to be like an homage to sort of 8-bit and 16-bit games of the late 20th century, and it's also supposed to be, and this is the part that got me, a combination of The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past and Diablo. Now, being a massive Zelda fan, this definitely interested me. Aside from that, I don't know a great deal about the game other than obviously what I've just told you, and the fact that the art style is amazing. So I'm going to jump straight in and experience this with you guys for the first time. It does also say that it's probably better played with a controller, but I don't have one to hand, so I'm going to be playing with mouse and keyboard. Anyway, with that out of the way, let's jump straight in. Aha, uh -huh. alright, seamless transition from the menu. So, W, S, and D to move around. In fact, let me just see, uh, okay, there are no controls. Uh, let's just work it out. So, Q does something. E might be interact. Left mouse button is to attack. Okay, cool. And the art style looks awesome. Right, look at this, we can help. Uh, right, okay, well, I'm hoping it might teach me as I go along. So, let's let's just, let's work it out and let's go. Yeah, this looks, this looks awesome. I like the character. He looks, he's got this sort of, I don't know whether it's intentional, but from here, the way that I'm looking at it, it looks like a sort of Tengu mask kind of thing. But anyway. Oh, I can jump as well. Oh, now I can kind of teleport. All right. Oh, I like this. Okay, right. Where else have we got? All right. Cool. Well, here it looks like my first dungeon or something. Somewhere to venture through. These guys look like the... Uh... Oh. Oh, I wanted to smash the big one. Oh well. Break this. This is cool. Oh, there's something over here. Here we go. Aha! The door. All right. What happens if I stand on this one? Oh, I see. So. Imagine, oh wait, one's, one's over there, and one is over. Whoa, okay, I did something. Oh, I get it, I get it, alright. So then if I go over here. Ah, uh, right, I need these four things. Okay, right, we're progress. Okay, let's work this way. Then. Wait, is this a pathway? Oh no! <laughs> this is definitely like Zelda. It's like, hey, which way do you want to go? You can go left, right, or up. Um... I'm going to go up for now, because I opened this door already. I'll come back here after. No doubt it will lead us back to the same place. Uh... There's my little fairy with me as well. Let's see what can I do. Oh, another door up here. Let me just check everything around here. This looks like it's a button I can interact with. Or, or something I can smash. Smashing is good for me. I can, I'll smash and interact. No worries. Hey, give me my crystal. I guess it might be in here. Aha, enemies. Get back. Alright. Crazy sort of brain looking eye thing over there. Can I teleport through here? Okay, no. Oh, but can I jump over there? No, apparently not. Okay. Alright, get back up. Let's find out. Oh, haha. -ha, I did not know that. I have a gun. Alright. Oh, wait. In, in that case, these are. These must be. Nope, never mind. I thought that might be ammo. Okay. So. Yeah, take that. Haha. <laughs> Alright. Can I... No! Whoa! Sorry guys. Sorry, 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 sorry. Alright, so. Back across here. Oh, wow! <laughs> okay, sorry. Right, I've been a complete idiot all this time. 
I'm thinking there's me sort of playing pressing the arrow keys, thinking that that's where I'm jumping to. No, it's jumping to wherever my mouse cursor is. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is easy. I go do do do. Oh wow. All right. Sorry guys, bit of a noob moment there, but anyway. That is the reason, I guess that's the reason they said it plays better with a controller. Because obviously you'd be looking in that direction instead of just it's me ignoring the mouse and doing silly things. But that's cool. It doesn't mean that I'm, I'm for now free to sort of jump around like this, like a ninja. Why? Yeah, yeah look at this. Why? Oh, this has just opened up my world now. I say this makes it better with a mouse. What the? What the? What the? I'm never going to walk ever again. <laughs> Alright, I might leave for a little bit. But that's just so much fun. Oh, whoa, okay, right. I, yep, yep, yep. Okay. Let's run around in circles. Or just kill it. That'll do. I like that option. Who's Dura? Ha ha. Charge that. Zoom, zoom. Oh, what's this over here? Before I go anywhere? Cool, more boxes. Oh, I keep getting sidetracked. This is definitely what happens to me in Zelda whenever I play. I go into a dungeon, I'm like, oh, I'll just go across this way first. But no, I'm gonna come here. Is there a map? A map would be really handy. But no, it seems not. All right, oh well. Aha. This must be the bit I've been looking for. Come on then, let's go, let's fight. I got you guys. You can't get me, I'm like... Wahaha! Yeah mate, get away from me. What do you want? Wahaha! I am like a ninja out here. It's over there. Can I shoot you? Is this like a secret? Oh wait, hang on. No, maybe not. Oh well. Maybe not. Whoa! Whoopsie. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Oh, I've got to fight him all over again. Alright. Let's do it. Which means you guys have to go through this pain all over again. Next. Oh, whoa. crap, crap. Okay, I'm low on health. I do want to watch out. Uh, let's go here and then go. Alright, back over here. Thank you. Health back. All right, we're okay. We're okay. Oh, here we go. So, oh, cool. He's giving me an upgrade for my gun. I can now charge that as well. Ooh, oi, sniper! Ha <laughs> ha! I like it. Are you on some? No, mate. Sit down. <laughs> Boom. Oh, oh, no. Okay, right. That button I was pressing before. Switch. All oh, right. Switch between. Okay, E switch between my guns. Well, I'll take the charging gun. Alright. Uh, 
Uh, this way, this way. All right, let's go. But the charging one obviously does use a lot more ammo, so I need to manage that accordingly. It's not necessarily always going to be the answer. Oh, whoa. Yeah, you're the one that got me last time. No, not falling like this time. Oh. I do want to watch out for health. Okay, thank you for telling me how I'm low on health. But I kind of know that. This looks like a potentially sort of more final door. No, no, it's not. Still. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, shit, no. I had the wrong gun, I couldn't, you can't move and shoot with that, that laser one. Oh okay, at least I'm spawning here. Let me change that. Throwing circles. There we go, that's better. Get away from me, you can't do anything. Oh, whoa, 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 you can then. Okay, right, whoa, 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 this gets a bit hectic. Nice. I consider that a success. What do I do here? Uh, change gun? Nope, nothing. Alright. Keep going, I guess. Oh, whoa. I love this teleport thing, it's just so ridiculously awesome. There's another one of these here as well. I reckon it must be like a new power or something I need to get. Okay, that sounds ominous. I hear like this big pulsating and vibrating noise. Feels like I'm getting approaching what could potentially be considered like a boss room or a mini boss room. It's got that kind of vibe to it. Okay, right. Oh, right. That's a spawning portal. Okay. Whoa. Rapid fire. Yes, mate. I'll have that. Oh, no. I need to manage my health a little bit more. Taking some hits like an idiot. Whoa. Crap. Things like that I need to avoid doing. I just see these guys like regular scrub songs, like, oh, oh, I can just take them, but clearly I can't. Well, I can, but you know. Everything in moderation. No, mate. Sniped. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, you know what? Let me just shoot. I don't have time for your, your rubbish. There we go, right. 
Oh, you think you can dodge bullets, eh? Try to dodge this then. Oh, flashing health again. Alright, let me go get the health box. Nah, mate. Okay, right, have a little. Oh, he looks kind of great. Well, <laughs> rapid fire made easy work of him. Come here, come on. I can see you. No, mate. Oh, that was your head. Look, that's his head. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, right, they jump. That's fine. It's a long old dungeon. Oh, it's the eyeballs from earlier. Aha! There we go, that's what I was looking for. There we go, we now have key number two. And then that is the door to the next area. All right, well, that seems like an opportune moment to end this episode for the time being. So that was episode one of Hyper Light Drifter. I am definitely going to be playing much more of this game. This game is awesome. So uh, tune back in next episode, and we're going to go on the quest for the next key. I imagine you've got to get all four keys, and then we go in and fight the boss. So that's going to be pretty awesome. So yeah, next time I'll get the next kind of one or two, depending on how long it takes. Um, but as always, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Hit the like button. Show your support. It does really help me out. Obviously, don't forget to subscribe for daily gaming videos. Also, drop a comment down below and let me know if you've played this already, or you kind of like, or you're considering playing it. And also, let me know if you want to see more of this game as well. So, thanks for watching, take it easy, catch you next time, peace out. Well, you can get away with three pieces and the exotic, because otherwise, if you have your conventional set, like for example, these are the new monarchy boots, they will cap out at 27 light, but you need 30 light on each piece in order to get to level 30. So, if you just use your regular gear, then you'll cap off at level 29. Anyway, that being said,